Yo, <clears throat> God dang. Yo, what is up, YouTube? Welcome back to another video. Welcome back to the Washington with Freeman channel. And I'm here reacting to six, 16 miles versus one fake. All right, man, now, I love watching Jubilee videos. I'm always trying to figure out who is who, who is that. Jubilee all around is a banger. That's a banger channel. Let's be honest here. Let's get straight into the reaction video, though. Elma. Elma. Oh my gosh, she's so cute. We brought together let 17 me, Let me move the mic right quick. I am a teen mom. I am a teen mom. I am a teen mom. I'm a teen mom. I'm a teen mom. I'm a teen mom. I'm a teen mom. No, I'm a teen mom. One. God dang, 14. If the group discovers who the liar is, they'll win a cash prize. If the liar survives, they win the cash prize. I should this check the candidates. Is Old man out. Old man out. That same little bit forced right there, no cap. But if y'all see the quality, it's a little different. I got a new uh, webcam. Having a baby, like your life just changes like that. I think what's gonna set the mole and a real teen mom apart is the details. Have you lost or have you gained friends? Are you still with your baby's father? I definitely wouldn't have known what the hell goes on during the postpartum stage or like after birth, stuff like that. If I do too much, people are gonna be suspicious of me and think that I'm like overdoing it. I feel confident, but I'm nervous. 14? Oh, we'll probably be Who like did that, bro? Maybe like a big sister. Hi. 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 That's How up. old everyone's? Wait, the babies or us? Both. <laughs> I turned 18 in August and my baby's 10 months, but he turns 11 months tomorrow. Almost a year, oh my goodness. That's so exciting. I am 15 and my baby is four months. I'm 19 and my daughter just turned 21 months today. I'm 17 and I've got an eight month old. I am 19 and I have a two year old daughter. I just turned 18. My right. daughter's two and a half. She just turned two in April. I'm 14 and I have an eight month old and she turns one in March. So how about your guys' birth story? How long were you guys in labor? I was in labor for 47 hours. It was miserable. Oh my it was God. I was in labor for 11 hours. I'm jealous. Labor is no joke. Did you guys have epidurals or did you guys go natural? I had an epidural. epidural. I can't do natural. Did anybody get induced? Like half and half. Like they broke my waters. I didn't even want an epidural, but at like 38 hours, I was like, like I'm either gonna, yeah, I was like, I'm gonna have to have a C-section. Like I have no strength left in my body. I only got to six centimeters. That's why I had to have a C-section. Your body wouldn't progress. Um, the umbilical cord was wrapped around her neck. Same, my baby, he came out all blue God, and purple. It was, he didn't even cry when he came out. I was literally so Same with my baby. Nah, my baby didn't either. When I didn't hear him cry, I was just like, Please tell me my baby's okay. I bet your heart just dropped. Yes. They don't cry so for a while though. Hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. Let me look at all. Let me look at all these faces right here while she's telling that story. Okay. Yeah, I'm not getting anything. I'm not gonna cap to you. Don't cry wet, yeah. Right? It's hard to tell. Like the movies, they, they just cry like, like that. A minute. <laughs> it takes I was a so scared. We just all seemed like we were just. Teen moms just chatting, having a good time. Hey, like, get her out of here. Everyone's stories because I know not. She's too happy about this. Thing, so it's like nice. But she do got a two. Like she do got a two year old. Like mom, and I feel like so. Shauna, the other three, they were quite quiet. So far, I'm the most suspicious of Kira. This is a total random guess. I'm so sorry, girl, but I'm. Man, that baby got a head on him. Emma really stuck out to me. She is who I will be voting on. I am definitely most suspicious of Kayana. I think I'm saying her name right. I think. Why? I don't know. I'm gonna vote off Kimberly. I'm kind of suspicious of Kayla. I think this round I'm gonna vote out Kayla. I'm so sorry, girl. She was just not giving me mom vibes. The votes are in, and we have a tie between hey, Kimberly and Kayla. It's, it's, it's Chayana. Going into a tiebreaker. It's Chayana. Each one Ch of you will get. Dang, I can't say names right. It's Chayana though. I know it. I know Kayla. it. I know it. Come on. So Let's be I for real. realized that I was pregnant when I was 16. Gave birth 17. Now I'm 18 years old. I'm balancing school while raising my 10 baby my mom was a teen mom so like it was just like really hard having to come out with that because i feel like it made it seem like i was like following her footsteps and she was like really disappointed about that so that was like really hard for me. that's I believable I was pregnant july 19 with my boyfriend he bought me the pregnancy test i told my mom well she found out because she noticed because i was really open about my period to her she made me take a pregnancy test in front of her and my dad um, was outside the restroom. We told the school they had found resources and I moved into a school for pregnant teens and teen moms. Not a air, bro! Um, 
That's not the even votes fair, for the bro. tiebreaker are in, and the team mom eliminated in round one. It's gonna be is Kimberly. Kayla. Bye. What? Her, both of their stories were amazing. I thought she was a teen mom. I had to vote for Kayla just because Kimberly had a strong story. I wish I would have stayed Both of them had her. strong so stories, though. You, I guess. I would have got Kimberly up out of here, baby. no cap. She only cries when she's trying to go to sleep and you will not stand up. Say hi. Right now, she's learning how to use her hands and stuff. Because she's so young, I don't really have, like, her favorite things. But she does love Coco Melon. Like, if she's asleep and I put Coco Melon on, Coco she'll wake Melon. up and She loves animals. This girl, <laughs> this girl is not a Hey, hey, whoa. Bearded dragon. Hold on. on. Saffron, the second she... Let me look at all of them. Boy, that baby head long, man. Bro, it's gotta be Chana, bro. That look like her Lux little Lux sister or something, bro. It's gotta be Chana. He's currently teething, so he's had a lot of sleepless nights, which is why he's actually up this late because I'm in the UK. He is usually all around a happy little boy, giggling, smiling, always around the UK. Anything. Her favorite thing is Coco Melon. Coco Melon. She Flippy. She loves to do little dance parties. What's your favorite color? Pink. What's your favorite animal? Elmo. Elmo. <laughs> Uh, her yeah, that's that's her know, that's her daughter. Her dad is not involved, but she's still thriving. She likes eating a lot. Everything I eat, she eats too. She crawls a lot now. She's very talkative and very friendly. Like she won't cry with anyone. <laughs> she's hungry right now. Her favorite things are unicorns, dressing up, being a princess. You love princesses, huh? Okay, good, good catch, good catch. It was kind of a that's her sister, bro. Today, but we managed to do it, right? Oh yeah. Whenever you meet her, she just like won't say much, and she's pretty reserved. Pardon? Do you I have one already. I thought it was really cool seeing all the babies. They all looked exactly like their moms. I feel like people might suspect me because I have a toddler, and the rest of them had like babies who were like super attached to them. I don't know if we've. That's not it, bro. You just that just like your sister. Really weird suspicion about Kimberly. I'm just gonna go with Kimberly. No hey. valid explanation. <laughs> I am gonna go with Emma this time, like I did before, just because. Nah, in this situation, it ain't Emma. It ain't Emma. It ain't Emma. It ain't Emma. A little bit calmer than her. If I had to vote for someone, though, I think I would vote for Kiana. I want to say Why? I'm kind of suspicious of Kiana. So Dang. I figured out how to say Kiana's name, and I say I'm still most. Suspicious God, of man, it done packed you up in a scared. box. But like, why do that baby look so exactly baby. like her? I didn't really have too much to say about my child because she is so young. All the other moms had a lot to say. No, but please, no ads. Anti-American. Somebody, please give me an ad blocker, bro. Please. Raphael Warnock. And I got two ads. Your car this time. dealer will hate me for showing you this because I'm about to rip away their big fat commission. We'll see. I had thought I was pregnant for like a couple weeks, but I was kind of in denial. And so my boyfriend, my now fiance, but he was my boyfriend at the time. Oh, congratulations. Thank you. And so it's either Chana or Emma. I went to grab some candy and some snacks. But I don't believe it's Emma. It's got to be Chana. The cheapest pregnancy no test. Cap. And then I took it in the movie theater bathroom. When I came out, he just could read my face. And he said, you're pregnant, aren't you? And I said, yep. And he goes, well, we'll figure it what? out. He's never broken up. He's always been the best. Nah, that's not like a, so good. That's not like a dream I story. My pregnancy, it's either M or Chana. Yeah. I'm sorry, Emma. Literally, everybody was like, oh shut my up. Goodness. You and Chiana yeah. or whatever her name is. So, like my bad if I'm butchering your name. Much. Both of y'all got to get packed yeah, up in a I box. Y'all are done. The whole time I was pregnant so we could support her in. Yeah, that's my I feel like that sounds so my messed mom. up. Say they get picked up in a box. I and I was in trouble. And she took away my phone. I decided to text my friend on Messenger picked up on about my that. computer. And I was telling her that's that good I had sound a bunch good. of symptoms because she's also a teen mom. And she said, yeah, you're pregnant. And my mom had seen the text coming through my phone. So she read them no. and just let loose on me. And that then sound once my dad real. found out, he was 
the most supportive. My dad is like very religious, so he's like, things happen for a reason. We stand supportive parents. One thing that happened when I was in high school, I got a lot of judgment, so I had to move to online school, and some people actually TP'd my house mm. while I was pregnant. That's horrible. And wrote oh my God. Was, uh, a slut and a hoe. That's terrible. I'm so oh, That sounds realistic, <laughs> but that don't sound realistic at the same time. In June, I was getting period cramps, but my period wasn't coming, so I googled that up, and the first thing that came up was pregnancy. I had told my boyfriend, and never he Google came something, to my bro. House, but this was in July, and he brought the pregnancy test, and I took it, and he was happy. But um, I kind of had a blank expression on my face. I didn't really know what to think. I didn't want to believe it. I'm, I'm so emotional. Oh, oh bless me, girl. Don't it's cry. Okay. I'm gonna cry. cry. Especially if she's 14. I, I, I understand it. And my parents found out in August because they noticed that I wasn't getting my period. I had told a couple friends and they told me to abort, but I knew I wasn't gonna do that. They were really about to me pack her up out of here, man. It's been for almost three years. That's in crazy. February. Everyone loves um, my baby now. And <laughs> oh, girl. Fake love, man. Yeah, that's it. Like, I'm I'm really happy with how my life is right now. Good. And I wouldn't, oh, I love that. I wouldn't change so it happy. for anything. <laughs> Okay, so I was 15 when I found out I was pregnant. The first person I told was obviously my boyfriend, whose name is Zach. We didn't plan it, but he was like, no, you've got to keep it. We're amazing together. We're going to start a life together. Both my parents were really, really supportive. They explored so many routes of what I could have gone through. And it was amazing to have that support, especially from parents. But then about five months down the pregnancy line, me and my boyfriend actually broke up. We couldn't blocked each other we didn't talk to each other never saw each other on his due date he actually got back in contact with me and then we got back together and then our son was born four days later Aww. and we're still together now so i found out i was nice. pregnant at 15. my school is like again she's trying to lie trying to like make up a lot it's okay school, which is like a daycare type thing so they have a teen clinic where they like do like pregnancy tests like std checks like literally everything one day i went there after school with one of my good friends and i found out i was pregnant there the doctor just kind of walked into the room and she just like stood there so i'm like oh boy like, it's cap yeah <laughs> i kind of knew like from her like expression that I was pregnant and me and my boyfriend were only together Could for they fake they a age? month at the time and he was 14 and I was 15. He was just mainly really scared to tell his parents. Yeah, my parents were super supportive though. My mom was a teen mom herself. Thankfully, the school I go to has an infant lab, a daycare thing. I'm able to bring her to school with me still and this year is my last year. Woo -woo. Congrats! Oh, can't wait to graduate. Oh my goodness, I'm going to be the first in my family. <laughs> it's going to be so That's exciting. amazing. Either the mole is a really good actor or we already got it. It's you! Anyone! I don't know! Unfortunately, I'm going to vote Shanna out this round. Oh, yeah. I really hate to because she seems really nice. If we didn't vote out the mole, I'm going to be mad. I'm suspicious of Kira and I'm going to be voting for her. I'm still very, very suspicious of Kimberly. In the 20 seconds about me, like her. Y'all got beef. I swear she said her parents found out and they bought her her pregnancy test. Because I have to vote for one, I'm going to say Kimberly just for the fact that she had the least detail. She was the least descriptive. I think I'm going to vote for Kimberly. And then here I come, bro. We know John Ossoff hid payments from Chinese communists, and Ossoff criticized John. Mm. I'm so sorry. I I had no idea who to vote for. I feel bad. I'm sorry. I feel like they voted me out because I was crying. I don't know. I guess I'm emotional whenever I tell my story. You strike. Give me a thumbs up if you want to continue the game. If not, give me a thumbs down and you think you caught the mole and want to end the game right now. It's China, bro. Nerve-wracking. Yeah, I well, know. If the color that shows up is green, you all win. If it's red, the fake teen mom is still in the game, and you all lost. In three, it's two, red. one. What? what? You did it! I do it. Yeah, yeah. Girl. We, we did it. Oh my yeah. My bad, Channel. Oh, oh my gosh. Now I'm so anxious. Like, who was it? <gasps> was it Kimberly? The game is over, and the teen moms have won. We're also going to be gifting them the Akin to Experience, where they'll get to pick their favorite basics from our new interactive apparel brand. I would like to please hard. reveal yourself in three, two, one. <laughs> I knew it! I knew it! Oh no. my goodness! Oh, you did good. Good job. Oh, what?
That is one cute baby though. Oh my goodness. Whose baby is it? It's my mom's baby. <laughs> He's my little brother. I knew someone was gonna do that. I knew it. When you go out, do people think it's yours? Um, sometimes, yeah. Yeah, that's I've true. gotten that. I babysit him a lot. Bye, baby. Bye. Bye, Bye. everyone else. Bye. I was really trying to pack Chen up out of here, man. I'm sorry. Tiana. I don't know your name. I'm not even gonna front. Well, that'll be the end of the video, guys. Remember to like, comment, and subscribe. Comment on what you want me to react to next. And yeah, Instagram Freeman XI, and catch y'all in the next video. Peace.